everybody what's going on it's the daily divers here back at again with another episode of dumpster diving if you are new to the channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button to join the dumpster squad and please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and i have maya that is just bugging me look how pretty she is oh give me the paw give me the paw there we go but anyways guys um Sorry we didn't upload Tuesday. In the last video, I did mention that we were supposed to be getting a snowstorm, so we did get hit by it. We did check a couple places right before like it started getting like really, really bad outside, so we didn't really find anything. But we did go out last night. Practically everything is almost melted now because it is starting to warm up a lot. But um, we checked everywhere, and we didn't really find much because, like I said, there's still places without power and still a lot of shopping centers and stores shut down. And we did find this big bag from the $5 and under store. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it. So I just ripped the bag up, and as I see, we have a ton of those color pencils on the bottom of the bag. And, of course, Maya's got to sniff everything. Get out of here, baby. So let me start pulling stuff out. Um... Oh, they are in here. They are hidden in here. So we have a pack of headphones. They were just hiding right there. And I don't know what this is. Oh, here it is. We have these Skylander, um, what is it called? Trap team. Some sort of, I guess, like action figure toys. Um, so we got that. It just popped off the little thing. And we got, uh, oh, this is empty, a little squoosh. Squishos, squishos. I don't know how you pronounce that, but that's empty. We also have a, another empty box. Oh, this one has some stuff in it. Um, it's a glowing volcano, so you just make your own volcano. I do hear it. I don't, it might be new, who knows? It might be in there, cause, oh yeah. It looks like this has never been opened before, so that's cool. Um, this is, empty we actually have lights very similar to this around our tv got some crayons oh that are just falling all over the place and there is just a ton on the bottom of the bag as well here is some oh goodness um charcoal pencils big big pack of that actually never knew they sold charcoal pencils because if i did when i was in school i would have went and bought them there instead of the craft supply store um next off we have i guess this is just like a little notebook it says d and it looks like a donut yeah i guess it's like maybe like a little sketchbook or something um got empties 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 empty Oh, what is this? Oh, this is never opened. Um, mini glitter glue, like glue little container thingies. Um, I guess like you can make like little paintings out of them. I guess it's like little paint kind of thing. So that's pretty neat. Um, got some more empties, more empty stuff. Some more empties. It looks like I see some stools sitting back here. Got some markers that just went flying all over the place. I guess they're, um, oh, they're uh, wacky scented markers. So let me go ahead and just try to grab these real quick. So we got a ton of scented markers. So I basically just like took everything out of the bag. Um, I didn't realize there's a lot of water in this bag, but I'm just gonna show you guys real quick. Um, as you guys can see, there's just a ton of those glitter glues, um, the color pencils some crayons um there's one of these little cactus things but it's already been opened and it's kind of mixed in with all this stuff um a couple more empty boxes a little squishy and then we also have one of these little oil diffuser things um it is like completely soaked in there i don't know maybe if it was like the oils left in there or if it's just from the water and some broken sunglasses but that's basically everything in the bag and then i just have the empties right here and like i said i just sat out everything so um i can't remember exactly where i left off at but there is a lot of craft supply stuff mixed into here and i actually like these tins I think I'm gonna use these to like maybe keep like some of my, like my wax cube melts in here instead of like the plastic packagings. But um, also we have three stools that were in that bag. 
um, two white ones and then a white and blue one, like a turquoise kind of color. Um, the white one in the middle is, it's a little lopsided. I just got to rebend it into shape. But the other outside two are missing one like little boot on their, um, like the leg of the chair or the stool, whatever it's called. But um, I think I could probably buy one of like those little covers at a store or I might just wrap it. But they're pretty nice stools, got a metal top to it. Um, they are covered in some crayon a little bit. I don't know if the camera is going to pick it up or not. But they're pretty nice. I do like them. I'm probably going to sit these outside, like out in my garden or something. Or I might take one up in our bedroom. I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do with them. But um, yeah, guys, this is going to pretty much conclude this night's episode. Um, not a lot of things, but some really neat things. A lot of craft supply stuff, which I never really knew that they sold like paints and charcoal pencils and stuff like that. But um, a lot of like neat like crafting things. A ton of empty stuff. And it sucks that this entire bag is just covered in water. I guess maybe there was snow that got into it. I'm not 100% sure. But like I said, guys, this is going to conclude this night's episode. If you are new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to join the Dumpster Squad. And please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and tune in tomorrow night for another episode. <laughs>